Welcome back to the channel once again, fam. Hmm. You know, we're going we gonna to have to go down this road again, I see. Some of y'all are letting me down a little bit with your comments. Understand, I'm not upset with you, but you're definitely letting me down because you don't pay attention. Remember, when you hear my voice, you should be able to tell the difference between when I'm reading what someone else said and what I'm saying of my own opinion. I don't think some of y'all grasp that just yet. So let me give you an idea of what we have to deal with here at Dirt Media. Hmm. I'm going to read for you another conspiracy theory. I'm going to I'm going to hope that this makes as much obvious sense to some of y'all that um, got me wondering a little bit as it does to, well, me. So this is what this person captioned this particular video with. Is it just me or does it look like Quavo was watching something or someone closely in this first video and he seems rather agitated? If you anywhere, anywhere that is not your home, you should be watching your surroundings. If you are anywhere other than your home and you're a multimillionaire, you definitely should be watching your surroundings. So I'm sure there's a lot of people that if I had just reported this story, it's just what it is, you know, just another random conspiracy theory. Somebody would definitely just assume that it was me saying, oh, well, he was watching something. So that must mean something. So there's something more to it. It, it don't work that way. It don't work that way. It's obvious that this is just another fan conspiracy theory. I don't even know if that's even relevant this time around that. Um, it's just yeah, it's just made. But, you know, we got to sift through a lot of these to try to find the ones that make some sense, the ones that make no sense. And then present them in their rawness, if you will. And if you're wondering why I'm saying all this this way, oh, there's a specific reason. And it's for a few specific people. They know who they are. Don't worry. If it doesn't make sense to you, just ignore it. But either way, back to the um, conspiracy theory in this case. Yeah. Don't, don't you think it's obvious that if you're out, you should be watching your surroundings and again, I don't know the full story behind what was going on as far as betting in that sense. But if I was losing money, regardless of how much money I have, I'd be rather agitated. I mean, you know, you outside of your town, you know, you um a type of person that people wouldn't mind messing with just to get a rise out of them. Just for the um, what's that word y'all young folks use clout. Yeah, just for all that. Yeah, kind of obvious, ain't it? So imagine having to read through all these stories like this and try to find something that makes sense only to find something that's very obvious yeah so think about that the next time you want to use the word green you can't really be green on stating someone else's view can you anyway i digress that's enough of me attacking the crowd even though the crowd doesn't mind attacking anyway moving on you get the idea take everything with a grain of salt do research for yourself. We are simply a means of presenting you information that is being, well, presented. Because not everybody knows where to look. Do keep in mind, however, that if I do decide to state an opinion that we share here, it'll be obvious. So speak to that if you're going to speak to anything. Oh, I did it again, didn't I? Ah, well, whatever. I digress. Anyway, do your research. Be open minded. Take everything with a grain of salt and just think for yourselves and you'll go a lot farther in life than some people are making it seem like they will. Either way, that's enough of the attack and we'll be on to the next after this. What is the best gift that each of you guys have ever gotten? Yeah. My best gift for my brothers is my brothers. None of us would be here without each other. We hold each other up through hard times, through good times, we with each other. We all we got. I don't know nothing else. I, mean, I, got, I got to go with a more that, but... My mom, dude, gave me this ring right here. You know what I mean? When I, you know what I'm saying? It's a picture of me and her on it. That's fire. And it don't matter if I have every ring on my finger iced out, somebody will say something about this ring right here. Yeah. So it always, you know what I'm saying? It's always gonna stay with me too. You know what I mean? Like I ain't gonna never take it off. Like I take everything else off, but I don't never take this one off. Fire. Quay? You know what I mean? Like I just feel like, just I love the music with these boys, and that's something I mean, that mean a lot to me. Welcome back to the channel once again, fam. 
Mob Ties affiliate No Luck says that he wasn't at the bowling alley where the tragic incident that took the life of Takeoff happened on Tuesday after rumors began to circulate online about his involvement. The shooting occurred after a fight broke out apparently over a dice game at a private party at 810 Billions and Bowling in Houston. No Luck says that he was at a Smokey D party. I was not at a bowling alley, he wrote on Instagram after the incident. Please stop confusing me with people. I was at Smokey D party from 12 a.m. to 2.45 a.m., he added in a follow-up post. Takeoff's uncle and fellow Migos member Quavo was present at the time of the shooting, but was left unharmed. A 23-year-old man and a 24-year-old woman were also injured and were taken to a nearby hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. No suspects have been arrested as of now, and Houston Police Chief Troy Fenner says that the shooting occurred after the business closed its doors at about 2.30 a.m., meaning takeoff was likely with invited guests. Hmm. So this is what I mean when I say, although conspiracy theories are quote-unquote fun and all, as more and more small details like this tend to come out, well, those of us that like to just kind of get the facts as the facts come out and not convoluted with our own opinion, you know, kind of can start putting two and two together slowly. But, I mean, hey, I guess in some people's minds, where's the fun in that? So again, get ready, because there are, there are going to be more conspiracy theories, the ones that don't make a lick of sense. You'll see. Mark my words. Either way, that's all we got for you this time around. Be sure to drop us any comments or any concerns that you may have down in the comment section below. And while you're there, if you're enjoying what we're bringing you, make sure that you take just a couple of moments to stop, smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and ring that bell so that you too can stay up to date with the latest and greatest. And with that, we out of here. We've been Celebrity Media LLC. You guys have been great as always. Keep it locked here for the latest stories, the latest breaking news, and the latest updates. And we'll keep providing you with just that. But do be sure to be safe at all times. Until next time, and we'll see you then. Peace.